We are testing the durability of a BGS case. This is a BGS9 Corey Altridge. Never made it in the MLB. So we're just gonna we're gonna test it. We're gonna have a water test, cracking test, throwing it, hitting it with a hammer, stuff like that. And also uh, keep in mind it's one of the older BGS cases, so two thousand one. Yeah, the newer ones might be a little more protective and, and safe for the cards. So we're gonna have a water test yeah. now. Test of the water test. The sink is filled with hot water, and we will place the card in there, and it's going to be in there for a few minutes, and we'll see if any water gets into the case. So we'll now remove. Well, we now remove the card from the water. Now, yeah. pretty hot water. And we'll check to see. There is seemingly no water damage. What do you think? Just aside from the case being obviously <laughs> warm. <laughs> It seems like it survived pretty well. The there's case no, is warm. There's, there's, there's no notable damage on the actual card itself. All right, let's go to our next test. When you ready? It's, it's on oh. record. So here, Ben will test okay. the strength and security of the BGS holder by throwing it across the street. We're gonna throw it. It's gonna land over there. And we'll see if there's so let's, any... Let's see what happens. Damn it! <laughs> We're gonna reach. Now, Ben will test the strength and security of the BGS holder by tossing it across the street with a great deal of force. It's gonna land over there. And, uh, we're gonna Obviously, see. we know the card's gonna get banged up. We wanna see exactly how well it protects... How durable is this case? Yeah, right so let's go. Let's check it out! <laughs> Run! The BGS case is in fine condition. It's better than most of the ones you see on it's eBay. It's scratched so. on the top with a chip on the corner. Let's see a chip. But the card overall is not damaged, and that held up pretty well, wouldn't you say? I think it definitely held up well. I mean, better than I expected it to be. So let's go on to our next test. All right, so for this test, we will be throwing up the grading case and then we'll hit it not too hard with the baseball bat. Slow yeah. swing speed. Kind of like Carlos Delgado in 2007, but yeah, it's it's gonna be a, good test. a little faster. So, looked like it Damage. may have survived decently. I mean, there are noticeable chips, but the, the card the card is really safe. It's still in good condition. Considering this is indeed an older holder, there, it's thicker on the edges, which really helps. Yeah, it's sort it's, of into the inside a little bit. It's not quite inside of the uh, the cards area, but so, it's, it's in good condition. So in case you ever hit your it, card with a bat, you'll know it's 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 gonna probably hold up. So it passes so far, but we have a few more strenuous tests to see how it holds up in the end. How is this card going to hold up when it's falling down the stairs? You know, you pull it, you get the card in your mail, and then you drop it down the stairs. <laughs> that happens all the time. All right, let's see how this works. All right, so I'm going to throw this with great force down the, the stairs. Let's see how it holds up. I don't really do that. That was hard. <laughs> let's see. No other major damage. Everything seems to have held up fine. The, uh, the bat... And the throw got the chippage here, but it looks like it's in pretty good condition. So we're gonna do this this test again, this, the stairs test. In case, just in case you drop the card twice when you're getting it in the mail, this is another stairs test, just in case, because the other one wasn't that as good. Important. Yeah, it's pretty. It's important. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's fine. It's good. It's the case. You see, there's more noticeable chipping on the bottom. But the overall, the surface of the case is much better than it should be. Very it's nice. holding up all right. Now, there is a small chip on the back here on the yeah. actual card area. That could be. That could be. But, but it has not reached the card yet, so it's still good. Falling on concrete, it is impressive. Just in case you drop it twice. All right, we got more tests. Well, we know that a lot of you Beckett members are potters, so just in case you're ever holding one of your plants and you happen to drop it. On and this one's for... <laughs> That always happens. 
So we're gonna, Tom, we're where's gonna get the card? <laughs> where is the card? Where we're is gonna the get card? back to you after this with a, a synopsis of how that card went. We're currently looking for the, the lost card. We cleared the at rubble. The moment. Wait. We cannot where exactly it? f it's kinda gone. Oh, oh there, there it is. is. It looks actually like it survived. The card has not <laughs> the card is still not touched, even if that heavy thing Turn landed on it. Turn it over. Even though the, the slip with the the number on it is coming out. The, the slip. card is still in gem mint condition. So this so is we'll out. Be, so we'll be back to you with the, the next strenuous test that hopefully doesn't break more of Ben's household objects. The card is perched up against the uh, sidewalk and Tom is going to throw a baseball at the card and see if the card uh, can withstand the blow of the baseball. And uh, we're guessing maybe it can, so uh, here we go. There we go. Alright, the case has been hit. And amazingly, some chips did come off. This could be from the other contact, but the card is still protected. Really? Though the case is all damaged, BGS has protected this card to this yet? point. No, wow. This is an and awesome the case. crack has not reached into the card yet. So we'll have a, maybe one or two more tests and then we'll see whether BGS is really the, the Worthy case. Worthy of your grading choice. So here we are with Ben in our second to last trial and he is going to put the Beckett case under a a Ivanhoe. book of Ivanhoe by Walter Scott and it sucks. yeah it sucks so but it's worthy is the case better than the book most likely okay. Regar regardless of the outcome the case is definitely better than the, the book, book which is under the card alright all right, we'll see how that went the case survives again there is some chipping along the top but that's to be expected because we have pretty much damage to this point it's starting to open up right there. You can almost see the, the almost card see on it. some sides. But we still have one or two more tests to go. So. Corey Aldridge, you are safe. We'll see now. this. We'll see this right now. This, this is the final test, and we're fairly certain this test will finally break the card. We are going to use this hammer against this rock. Tom is wearing a catcher's mask, which will not protect him, but he will tilt his head away. I've never been a catcher, so, so I don't want to try. I'm going to put the camera right here, and you swing away. There's one. There's one. We'll go again. We'll go again. Oh, my God. Ladies and gentlemen. No, we'll go again. We'll go again. I hit the back. Wait, the first side. we have to have a uh, the oh, the card. card. <laughs> Come on, let's go. The card has been reached, and there is a rip in the card right there. All right, let's do it. One so, time. we'll have one more hammer hit to see. This PJ, wait, wait, Tom, I know you're pumped, but I need to run first. Wait, wait a sec, wait. Right. Yes! Ah! Done. It's been done. Done! There's no sign of the card it's at this done. point. done! The, oh, the card, the card remains, but the case is gone. And I would not agree, there's actually a... <laughs> the card is not really intact, there's a hole in the card. But this has all come at this final stage, so the card has survived it until this point. The case is in shards everywhere. So what do you this think is, about this, the durability of this test? I think you should definitely trust. So I think that with the conclusion of our, our Beckett grading tests, I think that it's it's obvious that you should never even consider grading a card with, with Beckett grading service. I mean. If they can't stand a simple hammer shot or two, what are they going to do when you when you drop your card? When anything happens to your card, if they can't protect this card, they can't protect your card. You know what, Tom? I think you're totally wrong. Yeah, so in our tests, we we had numerous tests, you know, and it it only finally broke when we were hitting it repeatedly with a hammer. And then you dropped it. And the card was still in great condition before it got the puncture holes from the hammer. You can see the prongs from the hammer in the card. So overall, I'm pretty sure BGS is the way to go. Uh, we'll try to get a PSA card to do this with, but BGS seems like the more sturdy choice, but we'll see with PSA. Any final thoughts? I hate you. So, uh, yeah, BGS is the way to go. Bye.
No, it's not. Don't Corey Alstrich. Corey